Gemini, welcome to your timeless zodiac sign reading for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Jupiter placements in your birth chart. All right, not all Geminis will be going through this scenario here before us today, so please take what resonates, leave the rest, and do not make it fit if it doesn't fit. If you find yourself confused, it may be not it may not be your reading. Okay, this could be a he he situation, a she she situation. A he she situation. If I say he he he, it could be a she she she. Flip the energies and the genders, how they resonate for you. Energies could be vice versa, even though I'm doing a Gemini reading. Keep in mind that we have Geminis or people that are watching for Gemini somewhere in their birth chart, as well as cross watchers, meaning someone other than a Gemini watching for a Gemini. Okay? What's not relevant to you can be relevant to someone else here. Please keep that in mind as well. And we're going to get to the heart of the matter. Thank you, Gemini, for being here. Thank you for your comments, your donations. I appreciate them all. If you haven't subscribed, I invite you to the tribe. And let's see what's going on for you. All right. Part of the matter for my Geminis. Let's see. One more shuffle. Chariot. Ch charge ahead with confidence. Stay strong and focused. With the death card at the bottom, a time of natural transition and transformation. So charging ahead, you may be going through an ascension, a transformation, a dark night of the soul at this time, entering another level. Okay, with charge ahead, with confidence, stay strong and focused. Alright, so something could be shifting within you right now, but you're going to be charging ahead soon. And stay strong and confident in where you're headed and where you're at at this time and focus on the goal and on your own path whatever that is for you all right let's see what else we got Gemini so the heart of the matter is victory also with the chariot okay so things are looking up you're headed somewhere where you're going to be victorious cancer energy some of you have cancer in your chart you could be a Gemini cancer cusper Or you could be dealing with one. Doesn't have to be though. Happiness, joy, happiness, abundance, and genuine love. There you go. Well, that's beautiful. And look at all the butterflies. So definitely, you guys have gone to a series of transformations. I feel in ascension. Um, so you're just entering like another level. I feel here, but this is like you're getting closer and closer to. Just really enjoying your life, okay? Um, being more in a joyful, a more peaceful state of being. That's what I'm getting. Okay, you could be feeling happy, joyful at this time. If you're not, things will shift, okay? 333 on the clock. Vulnerable. Embrace openness and authenticity. Find strength in sharing your true self with others for growth. Alright, being vulnerable, opening up to others and showing your true authentic self for growth to learn to throw you know information back and forth okay and giving someone who is consistently generous which can be both positive and negative when they give excessively okay some of you might have had to learn to receive here instead of just give 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 okay and be more vulnerable. I feel like uh, maybe some of you have been taken for granted a lot. But like that season is over. Because I feel like more happiness is coming into your life. Because you are going to open up more. Is what I'm getting. Embracing openness. Or that's what spirit is leading you towards. And letting you know that um, reciprocity is going to be had okay some of you have given a lot of yourself in the process of healing and ascending and going through a transformation and now is your time to receive all right 
the divine yes the divine bestowing upon you talents happiness and beauty beautiful got that rainbow there I just heard um, coming out of the dark to finally see the light now cuz it's shining on me cuz it's shining on me so you're coming out of the dark yes it's time it's time for happiness joy laughter no more dark times because I'm sensing a weird energy some of you are really going through that dark night of the soul right now okay this is this too shall pass it is temporary um, yeah bottom of the deck passion uncontrollable passion share between two people nice okay so you're being aligned here treasure genuine happiness lies within yourself needing no external search so if you've been looking for passion you know chemistry um, with someone you are the treasure here okay you're tapping into your own happiness your own sovereignty outside of anyone else allowing yourself to receive abundance treasure and abundance wow positive and beneficial material abundance material abundance you have happiness that's part of abundance but there's also material abundance with treasure wow what you guys tapping into I mean the chariot I told you victory success I mean because you have given so much of you I feel like the divine is bestowing upon you all kinds of blessings that's awesome yeah you got betrayed that's why Romantic triangle between three people. Ah, expectations that often lead to disappointment. Okay. I see. So this may have hindered you to open up for some time. But now is time. So I feel like a lot of you are having a heart activation as well. Which allows you, you know, to receive so you're not closed off to 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 things that are connected to love not just with a person but with all things okay let's see what else gemini yeah you're gonna have success you went to some through something unfair the treason wow so spirit is gonna bless you source is going to bless you they've been watching here mm -hmm. they've seen your struggles they've seen you pick up the pieces they've seen you close up when it comes to certain people and they've seen you persevere here motivation with happiness okay see how he's holding this plant and is growing nurturing growing a purification you've been in a process of growth yeah falling in love with vulnerable you may want to say something to someone and it requires you to open um, in order to grow to flourish or this could be someone in connection to you okay so take that out resonates information and receipts with giving somebody may be looking at their receipts <laughs> like damn I've been given too much <laughs> someone who is consistently generous which can be both positive and negative when they give excessively maybe somebody spend a little you spend a little too much on someone or on a specific gift okay huh maybe it's somebody that didn't deserve it or this is something you want to give someone the end game over okay gift giving is over <laughs> wow yeah the end of that whatever happened there the divine bestowed upon your t you talents happiness and beauty okay because I feel like you got the information you needed to close something out with whatever situation that was okay 
And I feel like it might have been it might have been a little costly. All right, you have to give 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 material things to someone in order to gain their love or trust. That they, that's not the person for you. All right, yeah, deceiver. Wow. Well, that sucks. Communication, mansion, judgment. Right now, the summer. Something about a, man a mansion and judgment here. Is there a court thing involved? The world, harm and destruction. Wow. Mediumship with stability. The success. So somebody here is getting some form of readings, or this is you getting readings to find out more about what's happening around you. Maybe that's what guided you to close this out for some of you. Or some of you may need a reading. I don't do personal readings, but make sure you, you, you know, make sure you trust who you're um, getting readings from, okay? Make sure they have a good rapport. Rapport? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know who this is for you, but you guys know. But yeah, that's the end of that with the world. So this ended right now around the summer. Now there could be something that has to do with court, with some sort of home. And you might have to communicate with this deceiver. Yeah, there's a battle with hospital. Damn. There's a fight breakout. Somebody went to the hospital with a battle here. Yeah. That's pretty crazy. Okay. Yeah, we hope it doesn't have to get that far. Alright, let's get some tarot here, Gemini. I don't know who's going through this, but... Yeah, King of Pentacles, Ten of Swords. Wow. Hmm. Damn, did you buy somebody a mansion? Going to court for that mansion. What's going on? <laughs> Who am I tapping into? Yeah, this, this is a wealthy man right here. Either under judgment, I don't know. Or you, yeah, the higher font. Motivation, happiness, relationship, or, you know, learning, leadership, um, spiritual teachings. Maybe somebody here is going to the church to get motivated, or just listening to God, getting in touch with God. Four of Wands with falling in love and vulnerable. I feel like either you or someone here has to be vulnerable because there's some 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 relationship coming together. It's a happy one, but one of you has to open up. Okay, the motivation is the connection. What else is going on? Seven of Pentacles. Wow, a lot of losses is what I heard with the gift giving. Queen of Swords, the end. So you spoke, you cut somebody out. You spoke your truth. All right, you said no more. You had enough information. You gave to a situation, and then you cut it out. All right, so either somebody wasn't vulnerable enough, they took too long, too slow, you blow energy, or you have someone coming in with that's going to create happiness because they're falling in love. They just need to be vulnerable, vulnerable enough to tell you. And you're over here focused on an ending here that happened. Okay. Queen of Swords. King or Queen of Swords. High Priestess. Wow. What's going on? Happiness with a High Priestess and a High Priest. With motivation. I'm getting motivational speakers coming together. Okay, you guys have hidden knowledge. That's a pair. Now, one of you could be religious, one of you could be spiritual, but it doesn't have to be because the Hierophant could also be a spiritual leader, a spiritual teacher. This is two people um, connected. And I see it here as well. The blue, the hot pink, or the red, if you want to call it that. 
coming into union and harmony. Huh. Wow, four cups. Either someone is afraid of rejection or that they miss the opportunity. So that's going to be different for some of you. 15, 15 on the clock. Yeah, Ten of Swords. You got betrayed here. So you have it you have information and receipts about what's been happening over time. Someone you were giving to. Ten of Wands, yeah, you dropped that burden. Okay. You chucked wood. <laughs> you sure did ten of swords, ten of wands. Wow. That was heavy. Game over for sure. Okay. Bottom of the deck we have the strength card. Somebody needs the strength to communicate something. But with the Knight of Swords and the Seven of Swords, this could be someone that self sabotaged and, you know, they missed the opportunity. I'm not sure. Okay, we have the magician, the king of wands, the knight the knight of, excuse me, the page of wands, and the six of wands with victory. So somebody either you are going towards someone or someone is coming towards you. They want to manifest something. Why do I feel like somebody's sneaking in because somebody else missed the opportunity? Because they were they were too shy or not able to be vulnerable? Because there was a third situation involved. Maybe somebody was in their ego, self-sabotaging, runner energy. Maybe they didn't feel like they were enough. We're going to clarify. But we have somebody that could be in the public eye here with the king and the king of wands and the six of wands. Somebody that could be younger than you. Maybe they're very creative. Okay. Chariot with the five. Oh, yeah. Somebody was in their ego. That's what it was. So they were manifesting some sort of... Um, what I'm getting is like they were addicted to being seen in a certain way. So somebody was like power tripping. They were, yeah, they were a runner. And I feel like you moved on. So change ahead with co charge ahead with confidence. Stay strong and focused. Somebody's in regret. Yeah, you walked away from that ass, and they're in their head about it. Or this is you. Take it out. Resonates because they they decided to invite a third party or go for a third party. Yeah, they're thinking about all this. Yeah, in the past they chose someone else that they thought they had a soul connection with. Or you were the or you were the one, the Empress, and they thought about coming towards you. But there was somebody else in the mix that they chose that um wanted to win at all costs with the five of swords and the three of pentacles. Okay, it's almost like somebody uh got in where they can fit in. Yeah, you're a whole empress with the nine of pentacles here. Out of sight, out of mind now. Somebody may want to apologize and heal this situation for giving to someone else. But you might have made a judgment call. I don't know. That's for some of you. Or they have to go they know they have to go through that transformation. Okay, with judgment, for rebirth, so they can move forward. King of Pentacles got their heart broken. They were playing the victim perhaps. So I feel like somebody Yeah, they finally got right and cut whoever this was that was taking advantage um taking all this money so if you weren't the one that was in this relationship with with someone that was just taking um and it's the person falling in love with you but they just weren't vulnerable enough to tell you and they you know chose a different path i feel like that person might have betrayed you you have information of that and you cut them off and now they're in regret because they chose the wrong one that's what I'm getting tell me about this higher font and high priestess yeah somebody else came in the mix there was conflicts yeah one of you was spiritual one of you was religious 
there was conflict and somebody was in their shadow you had to walk away they walked away from you possibly this could be a twin situation for some of you they held back they were in their shadow and you moved on okay yeah they, this person definitely chose someone else and they got it involved with yeah betrayed you or they got betrayed so five of wands what else here nine of cups so there may be someone else coming in because we do have happiness here page of cups with the tower this may be shocking nine of swords somebody sees you where their true happiness now the high priestess that you were right or something or their intuition is finally clear whoever that was was ego tripping yeah king of cups that they held back their feelings yep with the strength card they held back how they felt the chariot five of cups they see you followed your intuition is what I'm seeing and moved on that's what they that's how they're feeling okay well I mess around and got with somebody else somebody else so so what's going on here Yeah, the lovers you got betrayed by someone the lovers could be a twin especially with the four of wands yeah two of wands this person could have got betrayed by family to lead them in another direction is also what i'm seeing Whoa. so you know they chose what they chose energy Temperance. Seven of Cups. Yeah. Th this person was definitely in their shadow. They had fears. Okay. You were very patient, I feel here, and spirit is moving you elsewhere. Okay? Yeah. Eight of Cups. You're walking away from that devil. You made a judgment call. Yeah. So for, that's for whoever resonates, obviously. So what comes after all of that? Ten of Swords, Ten of Wands? Yeah, I can see why you would walk away. <laughs> okay. We have the Six of Wands, the Ace of Swords, and the Knight of Cups. Somebody wants to explain. They want to tell you the truth. Okay. They might may, they might want to fess up why they were you know ego tripping. Yeah. They're all in their head. They know they 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 know they might get rejected. Ace of Pentacles. You were the blessing. Somebody may want to give you a gift as a form of um, their apology. Yeah, the two of wands, two of pentacles, the queen of swords. Yeah, you, you're cutting ties with somebody. Maybe there's somebody else you are looking at. With the two of pentacles, ace of pentacles, and the two of wands. Looks to me like you're going a different direction. That's what I keep getting yeah towards happiness yeah far away in a distant land <laughs> the magician wow you're manifesting some past life stuff what so or somebody in the past wanted to steal your money or this is the person that they went for and all they did was take and broke their heart yeah stole all these fruits all these seeds that they planted somebody stole Wow, yeah, five of cups, regrets. 
Yeah. This person's single and healing right now. This person could be in the public eye for some of you. But yeah, they're they're going through a transformation. They do have feelings for you, but they need to heal their heart. Okay? There's a whole like transformation, awakening, enlightenment, activating their, their heart space. We do have the Emperor, but you know the Emperor could have been acting low vibe. Page of Swords watching you. And something is spinning though. The, the Wheel of Fortune is here. Uh, let's see what else is happening. Yeah. Healing Pathway. And some of you chose the Healing Pathway. So take that how it resonates. Yeah, abuse. Wow. I, I just have a feeling if, if it's somebody else that chose someone and they were gift giving to someone and it's not you, um, you know, although take it how it resonates, uh, somebody was definitely abused. It's like somebody was stealing from them, taken from them, using them for their money. See what else we got here. Whoa. We have family. Um, you could have family with someone here, or they had family with the third party. Twenty one adding up to three. Yeah. Oof. Twenty four. Or family could have tried stealing from you. Yeah, third party sitch situationship. Ice Queen. This person could have been with another air sign or there was a thief in the mix some of you had to cut some family members out because they were trying to steal or this is a warning for some of you yeah this may be a warning for some of you because I feel like you're coming into some sort of blessings, right? The divine is going to bestow upon you some blessings. Wow. We have voodoo and lust. I don't know who this is. This could be a queen of swords in reverse also. Um, if there's another air sign involved, obsession, Ugh. obsession and lust, work, labor, efforts, with love offer. Oh no. Yeah, you don't want a love offer from this. Whoever this is, is not in the right energy. Or let's see, let's look behind that. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Not today, Satan. Not today. <laughs> no access. Blocked. Yeah, there's some sort of legal matters going on. Now, it could be this person they were with that was lusty and doing some, and they were obsessed and doing voodoo on this person. Okay? And they were all confused. Yeah, because they were doing voodoo. There's something legal going on. Yeah. False narrative, throwing false narratives around about a, a pathway and a priestess. So somebody's talking crap about the high priestess that's in her north node. Mm -hmm. They made some sort of false documents. Somebody here did. Could be the karmic. The false documents about a soulmate. An achievement 
or they're trying to say that that's false, that you're meeting someone else. Manipulation. Love spell. House. Endings. So it's the end of a uh, living situation with a manipulator. Somebody, somebody's trying to portray to be someone's soulmate. This person has false, false achievements. Whoever this is, that they're, I feel like they're in their south node, whoever they were with. And maybe you're in thought about this. Because somebody tried to, yeah, somebody tried to make you look bad or something. Let me get a question here. Okay, so it says, what blessings are coming my way today? I'm telling you, you got some blessings coming. You already saw abundance, treasure, and then two paths. What happens if I take this action, and what effect will it have on my life? Okay, so you saw the crossroads, all right? So let's see. Let's see what this is about, because there are blessings here, but not everybody can come kind of energy. That's what I'm seeing. What blessings are coming my way today or, you know, soon? We have the Seven of Cups, so there's more than one blessing. King of Cups. Someone balanced. Someone that has, does go within. Maybe someone wise. Okay, we have Sag, Virgo, uh, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. This is giving me Dream Boy with Seven of Cups and King of Cups. Yeah, a soulmate. You're meeting a soulmate. A high vibrational soulmate. So, yeah, you have options. Yeah, they're watching you. Page of Swords. So that's the blessing after you went through this. So definitely, if this is a twin, they had a fall from grace, they betrayed you, you walked away from that, you made a judgment call, that's over. You cut it out. You're following your intuition, and it's leading you to the right path with the chariot and the high priestess. And the chariot, what's the heart of the matter? It's about forward movement. Okay? What else there? Nine of Swords. There may be some anxiety over this. Okay. There may be a moment of stagnation. Okay, before this comes in. This person could be going through an enlightenment. Or they're trying to figure this out with the Seven of Cups. What kind of connection this is. Yeah, they're holding back right now. Holding on to their feelings right now. Uh, why is that? Okay, yeah, this person could be healing or they're afraid to get their heart broken. But the sun is here. They have, this is a happy person at a distance. Yeah, they may want to manifest this. But they could be healing from something. Alright, now tell me about these two paths. And let me uh, grab all of these. Alright, path A. 
which let's say it's over here. Pathé, you're like hell to the no. <laughs> Fuck Pathé. <laughs> That's too funny. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah, that's the truth. <laughs> All right, so you made up your mind. <laughs> you are done. <laughs> ten of swords, ten of wands. Okay, I'm through with you. <laughs> exactly. You know the truth. You ain't budging. <laughs> okay, path B is this person, obviously. But uh, let's see what else. This new person. Four of Cups, Path B. Okay, something coming out of the blue. In a moment of reflection, I feel. In a moment of, what the fuck was all that about? <laughs> Why did I even meet this person? It was completely pointless. No, of course not. It wasn't pointless. It had its purpose, I'm sure. Um, Six of Pentacles, Reciprocity, okay, something's coming to you, so Path of Reciprocity, whoever's coming to you is a gift giver, hold on a second. Yep, King of Wands and the Emperor, okay, this is somebody that wants you to be their wife or husband take it how it resonates but this is somebody highly attractive too a leadership position they could have their own business um yeah i feel like this yeah ace of cups this is real love here this is someone that i don't feel like they're gonna want you to do much okay i feel like they like to be the man this is a provider um, not to say that, you know, you couldn't do anything, but I feel like this person's going to spoil you because you're going to be in the Queen of Pentacles. Then we have the Page of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles, Ace of Cups. And this person is also very protective about their relationships that they're in. Okay? So it looks to me like plan Path B <laughs> is your best option. 37, 37 on the clock. That's 10-10, that's judgment, so, okay. Because whatever happened over here, whoever that karmic they were with, or maybe their family members are just a little shady. I don't know. It could be their family members that were stealing from that person. I just feel like somebody here that you were in connection to, and if it was a twin, um, they were really misguided by their family and that karmic they were with. But that's, you know, that's their own issue. If they didn't understand how to put up boundaries and you know they were in a dark place so and I just feel like there's too many differences in beliefs somebody still has limited beliefs um, you know self-limiting beliefs all right Gemini that's what I have for you let me know in the comments if anybody resonates I wish you the best and I'll talk to you guys later peace